Krishna, who is Akarsham. He has magnetic attraction. Uh, uh, we are Krishna, and devotees sometimes called Karshni. So, Krishna, Madan Mohan, Cupid is bewildering everyone with his uh, seductive charm. Krishna's Madan Mohan puts Cupid into a state of bewilderment. But Radharani, the ultimate personification, devotion personified to its extreme, to its limits. <clears throat> Prema Rasasima. She's Madan Mohan Mohini. She can attract Krishna. <clears throat> Hare Krishna means also, sometimes Krishna is told as Hari, Hari. One meaning, who steals away. But Hare, Hare Krishna, Guru said, Radharani, she can steal the mind of Krishna. So Gurudev liked to quote this one sloka where um, a devotee is noticing that Krishna's mind has been stolen his mind, his absent, his mind, right? Like we were saying, Radharani can steal the mind of Krishna with her manohar ladus or divine serving mood. So he noticed that Krishna uh, is uh, lost his mind and in this sloka is offering his mind to him. And I see, you've lost your mind, so I'm offering mine to you. Um, and one devotee asked Srila Guru Maharaj, he said, um, and what did Krishna say? <laughs> it's one of these divine sloka concepts. There's not necessarily enough, but there's always some devotee. And then what did Krishna say? <laughs> to the devotee offering their mind. Guru Maharaj said, Krishna said, <laughs> oh, what little mind I have left, you want to take that? 